Welcome everybody to a first look video uh, for a new game that's on Steam. It came out on the 1st of December and that is Century Age of Ashes. And what is Century Age of Ashes? Well, it's a bit of a weird one. Um, I've gone for a tutorial and uh, one sort of match um, just to keep it fresh for you so you can see my first sort of impressions on it. But it's a sort of a dragon flight sim battle royale shootery thing yeah it's a, a bit of a weird one if i um click on here i'm playing on a my laptop with a ps5 controller so as you see here um on play there's a quick play six by six rank play six by six needs to get to level 10 for that one and a rookie three by three and yeah the it's a uh sort of there's a map you fly around with your dragon you've got abilities on so I'm using a uh, PlayStation 5 controller, so X circle, square and triangle, A, B, X, Y, if you're using a 360 or uh, Xbox controller. Um, I believe you can probably use mouse and keyboard, but I very rarely use mouse and keyboard. Oh um, yeah, you fly around, um, six in your team, six in the other, a la a Call of Duty type sort of first person shooter, but it's not a first person shooter, it's a third person sort of view. Fly around with your dragon and use abilities to kill them. Um, free to play uh, i've got this off steam so yeah there's a, a few other things so if you go to classes three classes at the moment but there's two subclasses uh, behind a phantom so you've got mystic shroud as a power and that will probably flip there we go to mine uh, so two lot of sort of abilities um on there um so i've used marauder and the hunter's mark which is pretty pretty decent actually it's sort of uh goes out marks a a target and um yeah you uh can see them in there there's uh an egg where's my egg du -du -du. beastery don't know no it's not the beastery there's an egg which for the love of me i can't remember how to get to um, anyway, it's uh, you can unlock classes and you have to do um, trials. Uh, where on earth is it? That's the battle pass. Ah, there we go. Nest pool. Um, so I can get an adult form um, dragon. I need to go through the growth steps that are on the right there. So... Um, and 500 experience points and it unlocks to the next level and there's seems four levels to unlock that so uh yeah we will do that so let's get into a six by six quick play game um choose the modes in which you battle in if matchmaking in a squad only the leader filters will be taken into account complete matches to unlock new game modes carnage two matches go to fire four matches okay a round based struggle for gold attack gold carriers and collect the cargo and then stash it in the coffers making use of the mighty artifacts to secure a lead carnage is the team deathmatch gets a fire and that's your flag carrying type thing okay let's go for spoils of war then and we'll see how we go so obviously there is a shop where you can buy stuff with real real money if that is your type of thing um new classes coming soon which is good boosters if you want them and gems for real world money uh if we go beastery here okay so you've got all of your different um dragons that you can get i wonder if they change can't overview them if it changes the the abilities and stuff that you get but we're joining our match so let's let's go in Sharkhildian Creek good good stuff We've got tips at the bottom I'm going to go Marauder and Hunter's Mark. I quite like um, 
Let's go frost bolts here. Um, um. So it's a interesting take on on this genre, and uh, let's say for the first battle that I I did, um, it was uh quite interesting. So thought I'd uh, take a look, record up my first impressions uh, for you guys just to to see what this game is about. Again, I I love myself a free to play game. Um, if people want to go and spend money on cosmetics and stuff and and going through it then that's all well and good it's just on the balance if um you know it's a pay to win then i tend to drop them games um for a pay to win now level four two wins three losses again first time i played this game mode so you have to bear with bear with So graphic wise it looks quite good um so you sort of fly around grab these things for some boosts Gonna die here. Ah, and I died. So I don't know, actually know what I'm doing. Again, just... I lost 100 coins. Okay. I'm guessing we have to collect it and then come back to our zone. So we killed them. And turn round. So I wonder if I have to come back here and... That's how you get gold. Let's just go here. Okay. Not quite sure. It said I need to go and kill or something. Just try to grab my way there. Killed that fool.
I think we died. Round lost. Okay. Well, I tried to pick up some... Um, some gold off a gold carrier. There we go. Oops. Eighteen gold. It's just let's just go. We've got eighty three gold here. Let's go and cash that in. this Let's come round. Take this thing out. Being hunted here. I think we died. Or, yeah, we lost that. Okay. So we lost the match, but... Again, just trying to understand what we need to, to do for that. Again, and that's the... It's a, a simple-ish thing. You go around, you've got abilities um, and cooldown. I banked 184 gold. Most of my team didn't probably why we lost but again if that's the first game so we've got 1326 so that's the egg next level up up to level two well we're in level two anyway 
Right, as you go to eggs, discover your new dragon. Okay. Glasses nest. Click hatch. And we've got this little baby. So we'll probably just need to growth him up now. Dragon hatchling. Congratulations, you have now become a caretaker to your first dragon hatchling. Yet it is frail figure and inexperience rules out any riding for now. To make it a potential, raise it by completing growth steps. So we need to dodge three fireballs. Okay. Which is okay. We'll probably do that as part of... Um, what we want so let's go for an unwrecked balls of war again maybe we'll try a, a different class phantom or wing guard so still matchmaking so he needs to play as a wing guard one time the Phantom is one time. Picked up five shields. And the next rules we get some coins and an icon. Back on this same map. Yeah, so it says, you know, low on stamina, try diving. So this, if I push R2, tap it and... Uh, so double click it but hold the second one down you get a um a speed boost and then using l2 um is a break and you can break and sharp turn and that can dodge things um let's try try the phantom here uh launches an explosion projectile unleashing a shockwave upon pressing the ability button a second time do mines let's go for mines why not? With someone who's level 11, so they've obviously played quite a bit. So then. I do like that mark though, because you. you, you Get trailed. The Apprentice. One kill, three assists, no deaths in the last match for Lexi. So you need to kill them. Grab some coins, go and... So on and so forth. Okay. Gonna keep away from these guys. Let's bank that. Brilliant pull. Great flying. some gold here let's go and get 
Drop off some gold. Oh, dead. There's a, a red sort of thing I should have um, done. Wow, lost. Lost some coins. Grab that. There we go. Happy with that one. Happy, happy with that one. We did a... Uh, a lot better that we killed someone we banked some we got some stuff i don't know what the hell i was doing for some of it but I'm dead. Yep. Knew that was going to happen. When I went through that fast tunnel. Really? Me trying to kill some people. It's 
Let's grab his shield. Oh, died. But we should win here. We did. I don't know what the hell I was doing on that. Fire Legion wins the match. Surely we dodged enough fireballs on that one. Dodging all over the place. I was fifth out of sixth. Okay. Well, have a look. Four deaths, two kills. Oh, well, it's not a, a kill-death ratio thing, so don't mind about that. Up to level three, we have, and we've got a new map. Uh... Nest. Yep, we dodged. So let's grow. We've got to eliminate one enemy. Let's play another another match. Uh, we've got Carnage this time, which is a kill team death match thing, which we'll have a look at. And we're going to play um, instead of the stealth boy as the Vanguard. I think. Vanguard? Wingard. So we've obviously did the Phantom last time. Um, wasn't too happy with the mines, actually. It wasn't great. Um, we're going to edit our icon. Let's do that. Background. The ruins. I'm going to go as the peasant. And we're into the sanctuary. Aldrin Sanctuary. Avoid burning through your stamina by using boost moderately. Capture the flag maps I'm generally not a massive fan of, but we'll give it a go at some point. And we'll go as the wing guard for this one. Smoke trail or blast? We'll go blast. De -de -de -de. Zenogiva Zeds Sapikun Me Ur of the ID Excellent, love that name Don't know why I went back then but we'll go for blast. I like tend to like offensive um, abilities. The pioneer. Who wins one loss? One kill, one assist, three deaths. It's just general kill death ma uh, team deathmatch.
lost him. find anybody you're dead super tang I had someone close but I just couldn't quite finish him off and then I forgot that I had blast on my square super tang Dogma. What? Couldn't even see him. You know, fucking hell, I was just dying so quickly. These guys have definitely played this more than me. Again, this is only my fourth match, so you have to let me be. First time using this. There we go, killed someone. Yes, Paul, that is just the epitome of how not to fly. Let's come up. Someone's behind me. Flying around not dying is at this moment in time pretty decent.
I don't know where anybody is. See, how come it is, right? Whenever I'm burning someone... They just melt. Well, they don't do anything. And then when I burn someone, then, oh, they're, they're, when they burn me, I just melt. I got a funny feeling we're going to lose this. Couldn't get right past him. It's fine. It's fine, I'm not the best. But again, fourth game, fourth game. Yeah. That's probably mostly me. I'm not going to lie. But, you know. Super Neng and Super Teng, well, they're probably playing together. Yeah, five deaths, one kill, no assists. Dogmo is the one that just kept killing me. But, that's fine. Aggressive training. Yeah. Not quite level four. Let's take a look at our egg here. You can complete daily missions to give you a key. Every seven days, your keys are automatically consumed to unlock a reward chest. And also complete weekly missions, granting you experience and coin rewards. Remember that eggs that are hatching need a dragon ear to evolve. Visit the nest to check on them from time to time. So let's go here. We can grow this. Use Wingard Salvation Surge five times on allies. Okay, looks like we let's play another one more, one more map here, and we will do the Salvation. Yeah, because that's that rush ability in. So we'll play one more and then we will uh, close up this uh, this video. But so far so good actually, I'm quite enjoying it. It's uh, just a different take on a, on a genre. Let's do Smoke Trail. Threes, twos, twos, threes. Okay, so all roughly the same sort of skill level. Da -da. Yeah, it's an interesting game. Interesting. Again, I just need to get better at it, of course. But, the, you know, the maps are... Well, the games are short and sweet. Chicken lucky. Two kills, one assist, two deaths. Last match. Let's go.
Go and deposit. Just cut through here. Get some more shield. Go and bank this 13 gold. I got the jewel though, so you know. I thought you have to bank the jewel. Oh well. Just bank these eighty one.
Going through there. Let's just go. Bank this. Go and do this. Go and grab this hundred gold in. There's that surge. Oh, come on. We're just about to blow it up. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Ah, oh, well. Again, for me, gaming's having fun. You don't have to win every single game. It's always nice, but... Uh, Zeo fan. Fair play to you guys. Fair play. You probably just went and banked a lot of things. I was top of mine. Two kills, no deaths. Good score. Um, yeah, there we go. So, there we go. That has been Century Age of Ashes. Um, yes, yeah, so it's just a different... It's almost like a shooter, right? It is like a shooter with abilities. Um, I quite like it, actually. It's just an easy game to... To, uh, yeah, just to pick up and play. It's a free to play. This is available on Steam. I'll put this Steam link in the uh, description. Uh, we will quickly go and uh, see what the um, the egg has to offer. Got some customization, but come in here. Let's grow our egg here. And uh, we've got the Warton Valley Wingard class. So we now need an egg. Um, customization. Dragon wise. Equip, uh, use the menu to equip a dragon or overview it. We've got this one. Doesn't look, it looks like it's just. Um, yeah, there's, there's no gameplay to that i would guess you've still got a salvation surge which pulls you up so yeah looks like they're just cosmetic is the word i was looking for uh but yeah this has been it this has been century age of ashes uh please like comment subscribe how are you find in the game you know what's your favorite class all of that good stuff let me know in the comments uh obviously uh tip strategies that stuff would always be appreciated in these types of games they're not my forte but uh they're my if i've got a few minutes to play and just want to dive in on a game this is the type of game that i like to play so thank you much everyone um, this will be it, and I'll see you all in the next one.